So I have um, a little tag for you guys. It is Winterlicious, and it was created by the fabulous Mac Barbie 07, or I don't know, I guess 07, I guess that's how you say it. Well, first off, the first question, which I'm actually looking at these on my computer because I shoot my videos on my computer. So if something doesn't look right, I apologize. I can't see myself. First thing is favorite winter nail polish, which I have two. First one is this Revlon in cream, excuse me, you know guys, no, I cannot pronounce things. Cream Brulee, and it is this lovely, like gold shimmery color. Then I have, which it's, um, an OPI, Nicole by OPI, and it is in the color My Empire, Empire My Rolls, and it is this nice gray color. So they're kind of like two, one is kind of like girly, and the other one is kind of a little bit more bold. So I, that's why I, I, I like to be girly sometimes, and I like to be a little bit bold, so this is what I have. Then the next question is favorite winter lip product and I have to go with any of the EOS chapsticks. I am not one to wear lipstick that often and most of the time you guys really whenever I put lipstick on is in my videos which I do. I do have one of the Revlon lip butters and I wear that a lot but I just got it so I can't be like oh this is my favorite lip, uh, winter lip product because I would be lying because I don't really wear them except for in my videos which I don't know if that's being false you guys but I feel like whenever I put it up but when I pull up the camera I just look washed out and I need some kind of color on my lips but it's this little chapstick and this is what it looks like and this one I think is strawberry which I have a mint one and I have like a yellow one I have all these different colors and EOS chapstick then most worn winter clothing piece which I have to go I have several here First off is any kind of like sweater, which this sweater I have had forever. And I mean like literally I've had it forever. I think I got it when I was a freshman in college. It came from American Eagle and I like it. And it's got these really nice like, well, all the sleeves are kind of curled up in each other. I'm sorry. Really, really, really long sleeves. And it's really nice because then I can like roll them up if I want to or pull them down over my hands. And yeah, you can tell the difference from where it was rolled up. And, you know, these kind of sweaters, which I have several of them here, but sweaters. And then I love my jackets, which I have this fabulous leather jacket, which it doesn't get that the, that cold here. So I live in the good old state of Louisiana, so it's kind of warm all year round. This fabulous leather jacket, and then, of course, my Columbia jackets, which I have several, which is the new one, new blue one. Columbia jackets. So that kind of stuff is kind of like what I like to wear in the winter time. Then the next question is most worn winter accessory and I have to go with scarves. Any type of scarves and this was just the only one I could find. Like I said it really hadn't got that cold here yet. But just you know long scarves. I have a couple of circle scarves. Any kind of scarves and then I love my fuzzy socks. I have to tell you I have a sad addiction Two fuzzy socks, any kind of fuzzy socks, Christmas fuzzy socks, regular fuzzy socks like this striped pair. I actually have on a pair that are like, um, right now I have on a pair. I'll take them off and show you guys. They look like this. So, yeah, fuzzy socks. Any kind of fuzzy socks. I like fuzzy socks and I like my scarves. I'm not a big hat person. I do have like a couple of little beanies and stuff like that, but I think scarves have to be like my number one like favorite accessory other than the fuzzy socks, which I don't know if fuzzy socks really count as an accessory. I don't know. Anyways, next question is favorite winter beverage. I like tea. I like any kind of tea. I know most people are like, oh, peppermint mocha or, you know, gingerbread latte or eggnog latte or whatever. I do like those and I like all of them from Starbucks. But I like my tea. Like, I like that I can just make a cup of tea anytime. Don't have to drive to Starbucks because Starbucks is, in on, is on the other side of town and it's kind of little bit of a drive it's not like that bad it's like five miles you know it takes like five minutes but you know I can sit in my house in my jammies and fix me a cup of tea and I I like any kind of tea Earl Grey green mint all kinds I like tea like I love tea next question is whoops I skipped one 
favorite winter scent slash candle, I'm sorry, um, is Winter from Bath and Body Works, which I love this candle. I've gone through so many of these already, and it smells delicious. It just, I don't know, it just smells like, I guess I expect winter. It smells like, it smells like snow, and there's like a faint hint of like, which, how would I know what snow smells like? I see snow like maybe every four years. So, I guess this is how I picture snow smelling. But it smells like, it has like a clean, like, I guess I picture sm snow smelling like clean, which it probably doesn't. I mean, obviously it's like rain, where, in a, you know, it's collected probably all the pollution and everything, but, and it has like a faint, like, fire scent, and it just smells really lovely. I've already gone through like three or four of these. I can't even count. That's how many I've gone through, but I love this winter scent from Bath and Body Works. Next one. I'm sorry, I'm like reading these questions, so you have to apologize if I'm like dead staring at you guys. I'm going to make sure I don't go out of order now. All-time favorite Christmas slash holiday movie. Mine is It's a Wonderful Life, which I'm freaking out right now because I cannot find my copy, and you know what's going to happen. I can't find my copy right now, but then after Christmas, I'll find my copy of It's a Wonderful Life. Love It's a Wonderful Life. Like, I've watched it. I watched it with my dad, like, every year when I go home, I'll watch it, you know, when it comes on TV. Like, I love It's a Wonderful Life. Like, hands down, It's a Wonderful Life. Next question. Favorite Christmas holiday song? Well, I would have to say Let It Snow, just because, like, I don't know, like, it's snowing outside and you get to cuddle with, with your significant other, whoever that may be, and I don't know, just, I, I like that song, though I do like Silent Night, that's another good one, but I don't really, like, listen to a lot of Christmas music just because, like, you listen to it and it kind of, I'm sorry guys, but it, it just gets old to me. And I know you only listen to it once a year, but I guess, I, I mean, I'll listen to it for a little bit and sometimes they turn on at work. But I just, I don't know, maybe I'm just not a big Christmas music person. Like, I just, I like it, but it's just, like, you hear it at work. You listen to it in your car during Christmas time. You go in Walmart and Starbucks and Bath and Body Works and all these other stores and they're all playing it and it just... It's just like, all right, I, I need to listen to something other than holiday music. So, next question is favorite holiday food or treat. And I love these. Every year I get so excited whenever the Christmas tree cakes from Little Debbie come out because these are my all-time favorite Little Debbie. Like, and I'm just like, oh my goodness, like, I can sit here, like, I just got these box yesterday, and there's only two left in here, so I can eat them, eat them, eat them till I get sick, which, oh, I love these, these are so good, so good. Next question, favorite Christmas decoration this year? I actually found these at the thrift store, and I thought they were kind of cool, which I'm actually, I'm going to use them for Christmas, but then I'll probably leave them out because they're really, really cool. I got these three little, and they're all different sizes, little tea light holders, and they have little stars on them, and they're just, I don't know, I just really like them, and I'm excited to put them out. So, they'll look really cool with like a tea light down in them, and you know, in with some like, I, I use maroon for my, uh, Christmas decorations will look really cool in with some maroon ribbon, and it's going to look really nice, and I like them. Next question. What is at the top of your Christmas list? Oops, these are going to fall. Hmm. Well, I've had a hard time, like, deciding, you know, what is at the absolute top of my Christmas list. I'm not sure. I have several different things that I really want. I really, really want a new camera, which I have a Canon and a DSLR and it's like the Canon D 300 or something and it come out in like 2003 and it's like really really old camera it does not shoot like film so I can't use it to like shoot my YouTube videos or anything like that I just I guess that's really what I want is a Nikon D 3100 it's not the most expensive Nikon out there and it's probably not the best but it does what I want it has good you know megapixels and all, you know, all the little stuff. I don't want to bore you with all that stuff, which I pay attention to it. Most people are just like, oh, I like this camera. I'm going to get it because it's the most expensive one. But I, I just, it does what I need. And I, because I don't need something big and fancy. So I guess a Nikon D3100. There are several other things that I want. And what's the next question? 
what are your plans for the holidays this year? Well, I'm planning on, you know, going home for Christmas Eve. Well, I mean, I'll probably be home a few days beforehand, but I'll just be with my family. And, of course, Christmas morning, we'll open gifts together. And then the day after Christmas, which, you guys, if you watch my channel, you know I absolutely love Lush. I plan on going to the Boxing Day sale for Lush, if you don't know anything about it. it basically, is it's buy one get one on all their Christmas products and any of the soaps that were made before November of that year. So basically you can really save a lot of money on all of these Lush stuff which a lot of their really a lot of their products that are really really good are their Christmas products. So it is a good like good way to save money. So I will be spending time with my family and after Christmas, the day after Christmas, probably like getting there when the ball opens <laughs> to get my Lush stuff, spending it, you know, with my boyfriend and going to Lush and spending it with my fabulous little other Lushies that will be storming the store to get all those fabulous deals. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'm sorry it is kind of lengthy and it could have been a lot shorter if I would have laid everything out in the order that the questions are. I apologize and until next time, bye!